Rob Banda is on a mission to beautify the Campion Trail in Irving with nothing more than his art. But when one of his pieces disappeared last August, it was time for him to grab the chainsaw and get back to work. Photojournalist Mike Kinney introducing us to the Texas Chainsaw Carver. I like beautiful, majestic animals. That's what I like to carve. My name is Rob Banda, and I'm a chainsaw carver. I am carving an eagle for the city of Irving to replace one of the ones that they stole uh, back in around August. So somebody walked into the trail with a hacksaw, uh, saw, it, saw it off at the legs, and and. Um, you know, hauled it out to the parking lot about a mile away. It's kind of shocking to me, like somebody would, somebody would do that. I did the original carvings on the trail. It was back when I was just starting, so my skill level isn't to what it is now. I replaced it with, uh, with four more. These are a lot nicer. I'll tell you what, it's a lost art. Chainsaw carving is something that's it's really big, but it's not that big in Texas. I think it's a really nice, nice way to uh, memorialize a tree. You know, when a tree falls down and, and you gotta cut it down, it's a great way to keep it alive. Once you carve in the feathers, the fine details of the feathers, uh, the burning just kinda, kinda brings it out because that's when it really comes to life, you know. You just gotta give back sometimes, so I'll just do as much as I can just to, you know, make Irving nice. Banda says he would like to carve another sculpture into a tree stump on the Campion Trail and will continue to add more of his work there in the future. And as for whoever took their own saw and cut something down and stole it, a couple of lumps of coal for you mm -hmm. coming around the corner. What a talent there, truly. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know how to, never had that vision. That, I, I, no. can't, I can't stare at that and go, okay, there's lots of feather. Yeah, beauty in the eye of the beholder talent. for sure. Big talent. I'm great at stick figures. You know, <laughs> I, I can do that.